Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, according to reports doing the rounds online, I think this next uh, video may cause a bit of debate because apparently now, if you are setting up a new installation of Windows 11, OneDrive is now automatically going to start backing up your desktop pictures, documents, music, and videos, which will get uploaded uh, into the cloud basically without your permission. Now, this is only on a clean installation of Windows, apparently, when this is happening now. So Microsoft have changed their tactics a little bit. And that's when you are signing in with a Microsoft account and obviously are connected to the online world. So you're using the internet. Now, this is one of the benefits of signing in with a local account. This will not happen. And I have posted a video a day or so ago, actually yesterday, that Microsoft really wants you to use a Microsoft account on Windows. And I'll leave that link down below and in the end screen. Now, you might say, okay, what is the so-called um, big deal of Microsoft backing up your different folders and files on a new installation of Windows by automatically turning on um, OneDrive backup? And as you may well know, with the default free version of OneDrive um, that comes bundled with Windows 10 and Windows 11 by default, you only get five gigabytes of storage. And obviously, um, if you've got quite a few folders when it comes to documents, pictures, videos, music, that five gigabytes is not going to last very long. In fact, it'll get used up in a couple of minutes for some folks. So obviously, this is where Microsoft now also can start promoting the Microsoft 365 plan. So if you're not that tech savvy, um, obviously, you don't really know what to do. So then you're almost forced into buying a 365 plan to get the extra storage so obviously a bit of a marketing tactic here with microsoft i think some would say which as mentioned could cause a bit of debate now just on a side note if you are using onedrive and obviously onedrive is installed on your pc which it will do by default and if you do not want your computer to back up everything when it comes to your um pictures, documents, music, videos, and so on. It's actually quite simple to turn that backup off. Now, obviously, this will not be the case if you're setting up a new Windows installation with a Microsoft account and connected to the internet. This is going to take place automatically. But once you are using Windows 11, you're all set up, and you don't want any backup taking place, what you can do is you just head to uh, your OneDrive little icon in the system tray. You right-click on that. You head up to settings and now you'll see sync and backup manage backup and then all you do is you toggle all of these off or the ones you don't want backed up you can turn those off as you can see i've turned off everything because i have my onedrive if i head to my account i have some other things i've backed up i have chosen to back up documents and pictures where obviously the backup does a bit more of a thorough job. So I would just suggest turning all of these off, all the ones relevant to your own personal choice and preference. Uh, because as you can see, as an example, my music folder has 28.2 gigabytes worth of music. And this is actually a backup of some old music of mine. I do mostly online streaming at the moment. So that already, um, if I was setting up a new installation of Windows, that already would deplete that five gigabytes of storage as i mentioned within a couple of minutes so there's just a kind of a simple example as to why i'm posting this video just to give you a heads up and uh, um, a bit of a cheeky move once again by microsoft as i like to call it but nonetheless i'm just putting it out there and keeping you posted so just turn off that backup if you don't want your your folders and like pictures documents music and videos to be backed up automatically into the cloud so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one